Please welcome the chick of my dreams, my wife, Marjorie. My name is Michael B. Jordan, but tonight, Michael B. hosting. Michael B. joking, and honestly, Michael B. nervous, be vulnerable. But don't worry, Michael B. all right. Because Michael B. in therapy. Your favorite movie star, Michael B. Jordan, is putting himself out there. On January 28th this year, the 36-year-old star made his Saturday Night Live hosting debut and made sure to plug his dating profile. Last year was a life-changing year for Jordan, who moved behind the camera for his first major directorial project, Creed III. Unfortunately, in 2022, he also went through a heartbreaking breakup with model Lori Harvey after over a year of dating. It appears the star is now exposing the dirty details that allegedly contributed to the fall of his relationship with Lori's famous parents, comedian Steve Harvey and his wife Marjorie, at the thick of it. Nearly eight months after their breakup, Harvey has moved on with her new man, actor Damon Idris, and Jordan can joke about the whole thing. I went through my very first public breakup, the Black Panther actor said in his opening monologue. Most people after a breakup are like, I'm gonna get in better shape. But I was already in Creed shape, so I had to be like, all right, I guess I'll learn a new language. Jordan and Lori Harvey were first spotted together in November 2020 and went public with their relationship in early 2021. While the actor and the SKN by LH founder were heavily featured on each other's Instagram feeds and stories during their relationship, the pair rarely spoke to the press about their relationship. I'm still private and I want to protect that, but it just felt like it was a moment of just wanting to put it out there and move on, Jordan told people in April 2021. I am extremely happy, but apparently the only predicament to the rather beautiful relationship between these two beautiful people was Lori's parents, Steve and Marjorie. For starters, Steve Harvey's wife, Marjorie Harvey, has been embroiled in a few incidents over the years, and it looks like Jordan managed to witness some during his time with the family. Even before the actor started dating Lori, Marjorie was accused of plagiarizing a blog article in 2018, which led to one of her most notable controversies. She had shared a remark on Instagram that was reminiscent of one Samantha Chin, a blogger, had published in 2017. Marjorie removed the post and apologized after facing anger for allegedly copying Chin's writing. The mother of three has faced criticism for her luxurious lifestyle, which some people see as a display of her money, in addition to the plagiarism problem. Her opulent vacations, beautiful outfits, and pricey jewelry have all drawn criticism. Marjorie, on the other hand, has justified her way of life by saying that she worked hard for what she has and is not ashamed of it. Marjorie's affluent lifestyle, which includes pricey vacations, fine clothing, and opulent mansions, has also drawn sharp criticism from the public. She has been charged with gold digging and utilizing Steve Harvey's money for personal benefit, according to some, but just who is Marjorie? Harvey's wife of over 15 years was born on October 10, 1964, in the United States. She is a fashion enthusiast, socialite, and philanthropist. She is best known for being Steve Harvey's wife, a well-known comedian, and a television host. Marjorie and Steve have been married since 2007, and their mixed family consists of seven kids. In 2017, Mary L. Vaughn, Steve Harvey's ex-wife, leveled several accusations against the well-known TV personality. According to Vaughn, Harvey cheated on her multiple times while they were married, including once with his present wife, Marjorie. Additionally, she claimed that Harvey had physically abused her while they were married, which the comedian adamantly denied. In her case, Vaughn asserted that Harvey's purported interference in her custody dispute caused her emotional pain, harassment, and the loss of her kid. Although she sought $60 million in damages, the case was ultimately thrown out. Despite being rejected, Vaughn's accusations received considerable media coverage and stirred up discontent among Harvey's supporters. While some individuals supported Harvey and questioned Vaughn's motivations, others expressed disappointment and even anger towards the celebrated TV host. In an interview with The Hollywood Reporter, Harvey himself addressed the charges. He called the lawsuit ridiculous and refuted all of the claims made against him. He also said that he thought the lawsuit was an effort to get money out of him. 
One incident that Michael B. Jordan supposedly witnessed about his almost-to-be mother-in-law happened in 2021 when Marjorie was embroiled in a plastic surgery scandal that garnered national attention. She allegedly underwent many operations in one day, including a facelift, breast lift, and liposuction. When a nurse who claimed to have helped with the procedures shared pictures and accusations about Marjorie using unlicensed doctors and taking shortcuts to save money on social media, the scandal broke out. Additionally, the nurse claimed that Marjorie had a history of subpar follow-up care, which resulted in difficulties and even hospitalization. The nurse and anyone else who propagated the rumors would be subject to legal action, according to Marjorie Harvey, who refuted the accusations. She stated that she had followed the appropriate post-operative care guidelines and had undergone the surgeries with renowned licensed doctors. The scandal brought to light the dangers of plastic surgery, as well as the necessity of choosing skilled surgeons and adhering to recommended aftercare. It also spurred a discussion about how Hollywood and the larger culture place a lot of pressure on individuals to look young and how that may affect people's self-esteem and body image. The incident eventually fizzled out, but it served as a warning that even famous people might fall victim to the flaws and hazards of cosmetic surgery. On the other hand, just like his wife, Steve is one scandalous man, and Jordan lived through some of them too. But first, let's give it to him. Steve Harvey is the jack of all trades. Besides being a famed stand-up comedian, Harvey has successful career stints as a host, an actor, a producer, and a writer. He indeed has a Midas touch. Had his guy friend that you want to be in a relationship with. <laughs> However, Harvey's career was not always rosy, as he has struggled to reach the position he enjoys today. His personal life has been tumultuous, as he has faced multiple divorces and a $60 million lawsuit. In 1981, when Harvey struggled to make a name for himself, he married Marsha Harvey. During that time, he stayed away from his family as he worked to become an established comedian, a struggle that eventually led to a divorce, with the couple separating in 1994. The split was rumored to result from Harvey cheating on his wife and deserting her when she was expecting their third child. Marsha, however, stayed away from the gossip mills. Since her split, she has published a few books and lives a low-key life. Then in 1996, Harvey married Mary Shackelford, a makeup artist. It was rumored that the comedian began his relationship with Mary when he was still married to Marsha. Serial cheat, huh? All the emails and uh, the text messages and the different... Apparently, Harvey met Mary in 1989 when he was a stand-up comedian. After seven years, Mary said yes to Harvey's proposal, and they tied the knot. The marriage lasted for only nine years as the couple separated in 2006. Even after the divorce, Mary stayed silent on their marriage and split. However, she discovered a private letter from Harvey's mistress, which caused an uproar. In 2011, Mary revealed her side of the story of their marriage and divorce. After her account, things became messy for the comedian. In 2017, Mary filed a $60 million lawsuit against her ex, claiming child torture and breach of contract, which she eventually lost. And it is after that that he married Marjorie and seems to have kept it in his pants to this day. But has he, though? No, it appears he hasn't. In 2018, rumors of the comedian warming Kris Jenner's bed almost broke into his home. There was a huge blowout fight, and Marjorie walked out threatening divorce, an insider revealed at the time. There's no way she was going to put up with Steve hanging around a man-eater like Kris, especially since he's proven time and again he can't be trusted. No. There are claims that Michael B. Jordan believes Harvey's bad example of moving from one woman to the other has affected his kids, Lori included, and looking at her dating history, it appears Jordan is more than right. Lori began her first public relationship in 2015 with Dutch soccer superstar Memphis Depay. On June 26, 2017, her father confirmed that Memphis popped the question and Lori happily accepted. Marjorie and I are proud to announce the engagement of our youngest daughter, Lori, to Memphis Depay. This young man is a good one. Congrats, he wrote on Twitter. Their engagement was short-lived because the couple parted ways in 2018. Lori opened up to her friend, Tayana Taylor, about their split during her appearance on Love to See It. I almost got married very young, she began. I felt like I hadn't really experienced anything. I didn't really know myself. I didn't really know what I liked or what I didn't like. I just feel like I hadn't really experienced life. Lori then began hanging out with R&B singer Trey Songs in late 2018. 
After they were spotted on several outings together, she hard launched her relationship with Trey on Insta in January 2019, sharing a since deleted pic of them cuddling with the caption, it is what it is. One month later, she deleted all photos of Trey from her Instagram, hinting at a possible breakup. Despite their split, there didn't appear to be any bad blood between the former couple. When Trey revealed that he had welcomed his first child, a baby boy named Noah, in May 2019, Lori commented, Aw, that little foot, happy for you, T, on his Instagram post. After Trey, paparazzi shared photos of Lori walking around New York City with bad boy records mogul Sean Diddy Combs. Later that July, the duo was spotted with matching outfits that seemingly confirmed rumors they were a couple. According to E! News, Lori and Diddy enjoyed a meal with her parents during a group vacation to Italy. The couple's romance eventually fizzled out, and by that October, Lori had unfollowed the producer and rapper on Instagram. Not yet tired of kissing her proverbial frogs, Lori quickly jumped to rapper Future, and that's when she eventually settled for Michael B. Jordan. But not even Jordan's gorgeous smile and attractive dimples kept Lori glued to him. She has since moved on with Damson Idris, who, by the way, used to be a good friend to Jordan. Really, Lori? Anyway, whatever Jordan claims to have seen with his potential parents-in-law, even some netizens saw from afar, like this one who tweeted, So everyone is talking about Marjorie and Steve Harvey? Okay, suppose people prove Steve and Marjorie are as scandalous as they are rumored. They are Hollywood and came from the hood. She was married to a drug dealer, so the rumors are no surprise. I don't see why it's a story. With a second fan throwing in a joke, Steve Harvey told us to not give it up before 90 days, but within that 90 days of meeting Marjorie, he had moved in with her. So there you have it. What is your take on this couple? Let us know in the comment section below. And that's it from us today. Until next time, thank you for watching.